Hey guys. <sighs> I'm driving home from work. There's lots of traffic. I cannot tell you how bad it is. But it's Friday, so I'm pretty used to it. I haven't done anything except for work and drive today, so it's gonna be a traffic vlog. I'm just gonna talk to you guys for a few minutes here. Um, first things first, you may have noticed there wasn't a vlog yesterday, and the whole point of Vlogtober was to put a video up every day, but I had to put my childhood cat to sleep and without going too much into it because I'll get upset I just wasn't able to record anything I mean I did record a one minute video just telling you guys what's going on but it I was still so upset I didn't want to upload it so I just don't think I should use that situation for any kind of views or but I do want to tell you guys what's going on and um that's why I didn't have a vlog up yesterday. I spent the whole day with my mom um, dealing with everything. So she was 18 years old and I'll miss her and I love her and that's all I'm gonna say about it. Cause I'll get upset. But I want you guys to know because that's what happened. And I think it's a pretty good reason to miss a video. And um, like I said, I recorded something but I just didn't feel right posting it. That's what happened yesterday. That's why there was no vlog yesterday. I'm still going to continue with Vlogtober. Um, today is the 20th, so we have 11 days of the month left. Can you believe that? It seems like it went by real fast, doesn't it? Um, it's currently around 4.30ish in the afternoon here in Phoenix, Arizona. It's a high of 87 degrees today. And I thought that was crazy because just two, maybe three months ago, I um, I was driving in 117 degree heat, so nice 30 degree temperature change. And today, I took a sweater to work, so we're getting there. I'm really excited. I've been checking the forecast. We we are gonna warm up again next week, supposedly, and I'm not looking forward to that. Um, that would be, I think, next Wednesday. It's supposed to be like 97. And notoriously, it's, it, it starts being cool here, literally Halloween night. If you've ever done Halloween in Phoenix, I'm gonna roll down this window because it's getting a little warm. Um, if you've ever done Halloween in Phoenix, you know that the night you go out, everybody dresses pretty um, light, you know, flip-flops, open-toed shoes, skirts, shorts. Um, if you wear a mask or any kind of full body costume, you're gonna be sweating. Um, but for some reason that night every t every Halloween that night gets cold and if you're out you know at parties or you know trick-or-treating past a certain point in the night you're gonna freeze last Halloween was a little different um, it was pretty warm <coughs> it stayed pretty warm um, Oh, excuse me. All night, I wore a Mike Myers costume. And, of course, that's the full white mask. And I was sweating nonstop. Like, I didn't want to wear it after a certain point. Um, but later on that night, it did get cool. And uh, I'm just ready for it to be nice the next few weeks. I'm ready. You don't understand unless you've been in 117 degree heat. Like gets old quick and I'm excited for sweaters and flannels and everything but fortunately in Arizona well I should say Arizona I say Phoenix because everywhere is different around here if you go up north it's already cold out there but um, in Phoenix where I'm from it's uh, 
It's not fall till November, pretty much. It doesn't hit fall till November, so. Yeah. Um, I am just sitting in traffic. You guys can see the cars around me, how slow they're going. I mean, this is pretty much my drive home two days a week. I got horrible traffic. Can't complain, it's only two days, right? So, it could be five days, and I would hate that. But, two days a week, this is what I, I deal with. Um, I thought maybe like just talking to you guys would be cool for this vlog because I don't know if you watch other vloggers, but there's a vlogger that I watch, uh, Peter Mon. Beast! And I don't have a fan, but he flips a fan. And um, half of his vlogs are just him driving around in the dark talking and I love it. I just listen to him and I... I just, uh, you know, catch up on his vlogs every now and then, see what he's up to. Um, I watch more of his main channel videos, and that's how I found his vlogs. But I thought it was really cool how he just takes the time to talk to everyone, to bring up topics, to discuss certain things. So I might start doing that a little bit. Uh, I mean, I'm just sitting here driving, so what else am I doing? The only other thing I would be doing is watching other YouTubers, listening to them on my Bluetooth. I got a Bluetooth system, so, you know, in the truck, I don't have that, but in the car, luckily, that's why I like to drive a car, I can put my phone um, on and connect it to my Bluetooth system, and I can listen to whatever, so, shout out to Peter Mon, uh, love your videos, and, um, yeah, I see. I'm a subscriber, so if you haven't seen Peter Mon and you love like, uh, I wouldn't call him a drama channel, but that's what he calls himself. He just, you know, there's a lot of different videos here. It's, I'm actually moving, so I'm going to roll this up so you guys can hear me. He just does um, videos about, you know, YouTube news, pretty much. I, I can't... I, I can't recall a video where it was about something other than a YouTuber. He loves YouTube. I love YouTube, so I check in every now and then when he has a, a video out just to see. Even if it's not a YouTuber that I watch, I've learned a lot about a lot of different YouTubers through him. Um, so yeah, this is my Piermon style vlog for today. <sighs> Traffic's not, not looking better, guys. Not looking any better. Okay, so, and I think he's in Indiana, and I've never been in Indiana or know anything about Indiana. When he talks about it, I find it interesting because I'm out here in the Southwest, he's out there in the Midwest, you know, it's a completely different world, so it's really interesting just seeing somebody else's point of view in their day and how they go about it and, and all that, so as you can see, I decided to dress a little nice. Work today. Usually I don't on Fridays, but like I said, it was a cool day today, and my biggest thing was sweat. I don't like wearing jeans and an undershirt and then polo if I'm gonna be in over 100 degree heat. That's just not fun. So I decided since it was a nice day, put some effort into dressing. But again, I wear. I I don't know if you guys heard this in the vlog before, I mentioned it before, but I work at 4 a.m. It's not fun dressing up at 4 a.m. I just want to go on whatever and, and go. And luckily, we don't really have a dress code at work, so you'll see people in basketball shirts and slides. You'll see people in, you know, button-ups, just polos. Usually, you'll see people like business professional, like me, just in polos, so me today usually I'm wearing shorts and a t-shirt and I love it because I had a dress code at my old work and I hated it it was like a uniform so I had to wear like the same two or three shirts every day worst material ever couldn't wear jeans had to wear slacks it was just ridiculous and even in the, the middle of summer I would have to dress like that so I take it definitely take advantage of the dress code I try not to only dress really casual on Saturdays with a hat. Hat days, Saturdays always hat day. 
but um, Wednesday I'll try to look nice because we have a lot of people there that aren't usually there during the rest of the week. Um, people from other teams and then Thursday and Friday are my long days so I try to dress comfortable because I'm literally there all day for 12 hours from 4 a.m. to 4 p.m. and uh, today I was pretty comfortable. what happened